Hi, welcome to this edition of II Doc. Today, dramatically, we are going to explain the difference between farsightedness, nearsightedness, and astigmatism. So, as you can see, we are in this beautiful green garden and we can hear birds in the background. And we want to learn what is this nearsightedness, farsightedness, astigmatism always talked about. So, let us imagine this tree is where the image needs to fall in the eye and let's say this is the ray of light ideally if in a perfect eye the image will fall right on the retina demonstrated as the stick touching the tree but what if the eyeball is too big that means the tree is far behind and the image falls in front of it this is known as nearsightedness such people can see things near to them but not far this type of disease can be rectified by putting concave or minus lenses in front of the eyes. And the opposite is when the eye is small and the image falls behind the eye. Now since we know the image cannot go behind a solid structure, so this is a virtual image, this can be corrected by using plus lenses or convex lenses. A third and more interesting is astigmatism. In this type of error, there is no single image formed. So instead, imagine it's topsy-turvy, curvy, and half the image is being formed in front and half is being formed behind. This can lead to a lot of eye irritation, headaches, known as asthenopia, because the eye constantly tries to bring it to focus on one point. And this can be corrected with mixture combination of lenses. Thank you.